Welcome! This video shows all the rigging accessories for the CCL system. The main rigging component is the CCL flying frame. It can be used for individual hangs of tops or subs, as an adapter between subs and tops in mixed hangs, and for ground stacks. To connect to the top of an array, it has two recesses at the front and a splay link at the rear. To pick up the flying frame, there are three load adapters. Two are meant for chain hoists and the third attaches to a rotor clamp. The respective pick point positions are determined in array calc. For applications where extreme up or down tilt is required, the length of the central beam can be extended with this accessory that comes with the frame. It can be attached to the front or to the rear of the flying frame. The pick point holes on the extension are marked X1 to X11. Array calc will indicate the pick point position in the same way when necessary. Also, the extender is required when flying subs. To use the flying frame as an adapter in mixed hangs or for ground stacks, you must fit two additional front links first. They are stored here, and this is how to mount them. Make sure to return them to the storage position after use. The flying frame features an opening at the front and a mounting plate for the DNB array site sender unit, which combines a laser aiming device an inclinometer, a thermometer and hygrometer. To operate the array site, use the meter unit. You can also connect it to the remote network and control it from R1. Some applications require more down tilt than the flying frame can provide. In these cases, you can mount the CCL pullback frame to the bottom of an array. The pullback frame may only be used with top arrays. It must not be used for mixed arrays. The pullback frame can also be used for ground stacks and connect to subs providing an M20 flange. The pullback frame may only be used if array calc is set to pullback and the load calculation shows green. In pullback mode, this is the only allowed pick point on the flying frame. Also, the direction of pull must be within 5 degrees of vertical. The CCL top and sub mounting frames are a more economic and compact alternative to the flying frame. They have a reduced load capacity. You can change the mounting accessory in array calc as shown here. All load limit and pick point calculations will adjust accordingly. CCL travels on touring carts. The carts carry up to four cabinets. They are also part of the rigging system. Every cart has two lids for chains and other metalware at the bottom. The lids are fitted with drain holes to prevent the accumulation of water. Also, there is a storage space for one of the frames. During transportation, a top lid protects the cabinets and provides further storage space. For additional protection, there is also a soft cover. CCL subs travel on a wheelboard. 